We are in South Khorasan with the Ashire kids. This is an amazing, this kid has been sitting here for a long time to, to have their breakfast. We just got here, so there is a lot to say. God, you can look around, it's so bare in here. There is, they have bare, 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 bare minimum and absolute nothing and they are surviving. I mean, hardship, amazing hardship that I've never witnessed. Beautiful children with extreme, extreme potential, with a lot of potential. It's just no opportunities. So we need to offer these opportunities to them. And I am asking you to help us continue this program. Now, can you look at them? Can you look at them with me? Look at how beautiful they are. Look at how precious they are. Holly, how do you feel? This is the first time you've been here. How do you feel? I have not seen barren land like this for I don't know how long. Driving in, I couldn't tell if it's an abandoned land or if it's a livable land. Just broken down huts and just rubbles and rubbles and rubbles. It's incredible that these kids actually get together and go have any kind of education. Thanks to whoever built this school, it's... Thank you. And the one meal a day, it's their only source of proper nutrition. Um, hard to imagine when we come from U.S. or anywhere with uh, city life. I would, it, it would be great if you show them around to see how ruined this place is, how barren this is. The trees and the, there's a little bit of a green in the ground because this is their green season and the rest is barren. I don't even know how in the summertime. It's high, high temperatures um, and heavy winters. So this is the best time of the year and it looks like this. It's gut-wrenching.